Hello everyone, I'm Dude 2, the Dude of Sports, the Duke of Entertainment. Sports fans, let's talk sports. Brunch time. Hold on, one, two, three. Franchise tag on Demarcus Lawrence. $17 million. They have to get the deal and done by Friday, and then they can work on a long-term deal. And then they can work on some deals with Prescott, Elliot. Sean Lee and Des Bryant. I think Des Bryant will be the first one that's really going to come down the pipe with Demarcus Lawrence, but this is a good start. This is a really good start to just getting his contracts done and playing some cowboy football. Because that's this this business side of the Dallas Cowboys is not something that Cowboy fans are really interested in, but if there's a player that they really want you to lock up and think about locking up right now, I think Demarcus Lawrence, because he's an incredible defensive end, and he really just shows every, well, if you look up highlight videos of him, you would know that he's pretty incredible, that he's pretty outstanding on what he can do, and I'm just I'm thinking that who is the next uh, contract that we're going to look at, is it really going to be Des Bryant? Because I think that will be a major contract to do. I think that will be a really big contract to look at. And if they could get something like rock solid and a price point where everybody's happy, Des Bryant's happy. Um. The Cowboys organizations, the Jerry Jones family is happy. But as I said, this is a good start to getting stuff done and getting ourselves ready for draft day. And hopefully, I know I, I've been saying this for maybe three years now, get ourselves some defensive players that we really need. And I'm not going to repeat it because I feel like I'm a broken record every time I repeat it. But I'm just, I just seen some of the draft picks that we have picked up and I'm thinking in my head, why? Why, 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 why do we need that? We, we need people to fill our defensive line and safeties, corners, so we can actually stop people from scoring and not just be able to score ourselves and then not be able to stop the other team. Because that gets frustrating. That gets really frustrating after season after season. I, I'm not saying that it happens every single season, but let's be positive. Let's just know that we, given this guy, this franchise tag, is the best thing that we have done in a long time. And I'm glad that we did it. I think Jerry Jones is really, might be listening to his children more, that he is handing over more of the responsibility. And that's a good thing. That is something that he's been needing to do for a long time. So why? <sighs> Progression and just seeing Jerry Jones that he has his sons more into the drafting and more of, well, I think Jerry Jones has a lot more to do with the contracts too, but you know, his sons and his family are more, they're 
to help Jerry Jones make the right decisions. Because sometimes, well, let's just say that Jerry Jones' contracts are kind of like him being in a candy store. And when he sees that nice little candy, and the same thing with drafting players, like Johnny Mandel, John, Johnny Manziel. I'm not saying that, well, I don't know, maybe the same thing would have happened if he was on our team. But the thing is, I think it was a good thing that we didn't draft Mon Johnny Manziel. I think it was a great thing. I think that it was the greatest thing that you tell Jerry, no, this is not what we need. We need to be smart and we need to draft smart. We don't need to just draft the most shiny piece of candy in the draft or the most shiny free agent out there. We need to draft the people that will help us in the long run. And I think Demarcus Lawrence will help us. And if we lose Des Bryant, we lose Des Bryant. There's nothing you can do about it. He says he wants to stay in Texas and hopefully that's how it, that's what he sticks to. And he'll work out a deal with Jerry Jones and we get a long-term deal with Demarcus Lawrence that will suit everybody. That we're going in the right, right direction of trying to get ourselves where we could where we can contend in the playoffs, win a championship game, maybe win that big game, and redeem ourselves. I'm not saying that we need to redeem ourselves just because the Eagles and New York football giants have won the Super Bowl before us. Hey, there's still that team, the Redskins. I wouldn't be surprised if they get good sooner than later. So, let's keep on doing this. Let's get ready for the draft, and let's make the Dallas Cowboys great again. Well, they are pretty great right now, but let's make them even greater. And as always, awesome, radical, Calabunga dude.